Oh god, what is this shit? Turn it off. Ugh. Yo, yo. Oh babe, yo. this is such a good episode. Welcome babe. To babe, the babe, Alpha babe. Inside Remember this one? podcast hosted by the biggest and braddest of them all. Nothing. Brad. Who's Brad? How much longer anyway? I told you we could have booked somewhere nicer. Closer. Oh, it's not much further, babe. Plus, you're gonna love it. I, t- I told you, we got the killer deal on this this weekend. And also, by the way, now that we're on the topic, um, we should have never let your mother plan the wedding. The photographer that you brought, that, that, that cost, that is way too expensive. I told you that my buddy Chet from back to college, he could have done it for free from his phone. Same quality. Wow. I thought the reception was lovely. <laughs> you are so your mother's daughter. That's all right, though. You are going to love our room, we promise. shared house? How are we supposed to get any privacy? Yeah, a shared house with a private room. We'll be fine. A zombie. Uh, yeah. I, I prefer the term undead super host. Uh, would you just excuse us just for one second? What seems to be the problem here? He's a zombie. Are you okay with this? Okay. Uh, one, the room's actually already paid for, and it's late, and we're already There's here. There's no and... way we'll make it out by morning. If it uh, helps you guys at all, you know I've actually been human free for about two years now. Years. <laughs> and uh, if I did eat ya, oh, I'd lose the uh, super host status. Super. Three years in a row. <laughs> All right, come on, why don't I show you to your rooms? Perfect. Come on. Oh, 
What happened? Oh. <laughs> <sighs> okay, I, I know a guy. He should be your ASAP. Do. What do you mean? You just took a whole chunk out of that guy. That's what you just did. No, no. Okay, listen. I will lose my super host status. So, so let's just. How about you guys help me take the body out, and and I'll refund your whole stay. Deal. No. Are you crazy? What do you want from me? It's a killer deal. Come on. I mean. Call the cops. That man is dead. Okay. No. It. He's not technically dead. It works different for our community. Okay. Listen. Greg probably wanted to change a pace in his life, anyways. Listen, listen, we'll do it in the morning, okay? Last night, I saw you out in the living room. Jazz? Sorry, I didn't mean to disturb you. Oh, no, no. I thought it was beautiful. What were you doing out so late? The undead don't really sleep, and I try not to cause too much of a ruckus, but nothing more beautiful than looking up at the night sky and listening to some Miles, Coal Train, and Lady Day. You like jazz? I do. I do. Uh, the last authentic art form, I like to say. That's what I say. Really had to choose the toss plumber. Brad would beg to differ. Why'd you even marry him? I don't mean to be so forward, but all I've seen so far is you're discontent with him. He wasn't always like this. Ever since he started that damn podcast, he's changed. Uncomfortable. Get out of your comfort zone. I'm hiding a body on my honeymoon. How much more out of my comfort zone do I get? I think you need a change. Are we freaking there yet already, or what? <laughs> Glad that's over. Hey, babe, will you be a doll? Get me any tissue, please. Hey, tissue, sure, tissue. honey. Woo, honey. I knew you'd come around. You know, babe, I was actually thinking about uh, my next pod for the next. Oh. Oh. What the hell, man? Janet, can you do something about this guy, please? Here, let me do it. Sounds like a killer deal. Who's Brad?